Alright, so if Zelda's released on global, of course, there's always, you know, an attempt of making him work. <laughs> um, going first with the blue one, of course I pulled both, I uh, went for getting both, but first of all, I go for the blue one, because it's more, more fun. I, I mean, the red one is, you know, objectively better, but you know, the blue one is just more fun, so. And the, the red one doesn't have um, draw yet, which is a big issue, but the blue one, if you haven't read what he does yet, once you lose an ultimate gauge, it boosts his crit damage by 30%, up to three times. His, you know, commandment really helps with that because when he move, when he or anyone in the match moves a card, they lose ultimate gauge and, uh, you know, takes off all their debuffs. He has a, a double crit damage card, which combined with his passive goes burr, and then his AOE card heals, and his ultimate really good. I mean, level one uh, didn't pull for any dupes, but you know, should work. This is your I'm bringing. I know, kind of rough in the on the edges. But let's see what we can do. Lost Vein uh, and Zaldris will take really, really good effect with the Death Pierce and the Slater. Because they're reducing the crit resistance so much, they're gonna be critting all the time, I hope. And here's the thing, I've been using Zaldris recently with Super Awakening. And Super Awakening, of course, increases crit chance. So I don't know about how, how it will be without it. Alright, what card did I get? Lost Vein. Hmm. Um, he can push for an ultimate. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hope that next turn I get another another Zaldus card. Yes, 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 yes. I'm going for the one shot on melee. That's what I'm going for. I mean, he could attack Xiaomi. Hmm. Oh, he's going for King's Ultimate. Interesting. Oh, he couldn't. He moved the card. He's going to attack Xiaomi. Yeah. There, no issue. Oh, actually, okay. Okay. <sighs> that will not kill Melly. Hopefully, Gopher will crit my uh, Lost Vein. Yeah, King's dead. Hopefully, go for a crit my melee. Zaldris' passive will max completely because Gopher will take off three ultimate gauge. So his passive is maxed. His ma his crit damage is gonna be ninety percent. And again, if he crits my Meliodas, I'll be getting level three, and that will kill his Meliodas for sure. No crit, unlucky. What's he doing with his melee? Rank up, is he killing the uh, Slater? No, he went for Zaldus. <sighs> no crits on, on him. Zaldus has really high crit resistance. So, we're going for this. This. This will do more damage if he crits. Zaldus might just one shot, actually. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was hoping for. And Zaldus fully heals pretty much. Because that crit on Gopher. Gopher, no, he has really high crit resistance by existing. Uh, but Slater and Death Pierce. That's why I'm bringing both. Well, it's a nice shield you got there. But, I don't know if you noticed, I am in fact using Zaldus. So your Gopher is dead. I am in fact using Zaldus. You can't just attack him like that. It's what got you the first time. The commandment is just... its It, it can be so good. It really can. No problem, crit. Nice. No problem for me. I will just do this. Actually... Yeah, he forfeited. Eh, either way. Worked out pretty well. Alright. Ooh, Eren. SR Eren or SSR Eren? SR Eren. The better one. <laughs> okay. Let's seal the king. So he can't cleanse or petrify. And I don't want to use Zaldris yet. Actually, I'll, I'll do this. So I'll get an ultimate gauge. And this, I guess. I'll use that just for the ultimate gauge. Oh, evasion. Okay. I wish I had actually attacked with Zaldris first. Because that attack was kind of mean meaningless. 
I didn't account for evasion. Okay. Really didn't account for evasion. Um, he could push an ultimate by using three cards, but he can't combine the card and push an ultimate. That's, an, again, another great thing about Zarya's commitment. When used properly, right? When it's in your side, it can be very annoying, but when you're using Zarya, you don't want to push for ults. So. Alright, let's see what he does. Attacks you? Yeah. Level 3 attacks you? No. Cradle Melee. That Cradle Melee uh, means that I'm gonna do this. Use Zaldris' uh, commitment to allow me to actually kill his king. I know it's not using Zaldris specifically, but I'm using his commitment in my favor. Which is very helpful, because now I got Melee's ultimate. And he's clueless on what you do now. Match is pretty laggy. Could be me. My Wi-Fi isn't the best right now. He, could, I, he can take away my ultimate gauge. I will... If he does take away my ultimate gauge, I'll combine Zaldus cards. That will, you know, proc his passive once. Oh, he can't take away. Unlucky for him. And he can't kill. There's no way. Yeah. Well, unlucky. Now, before I go... Before I kill with Philosophy, let me do this. And then ult, yeah. I just want to see the damage. Please crit. Nice. 58k on ungeared is pretty good. For the... Alright, let's, uh, let's take it to... Uh, mm. I want to take it to geared. Let me play one more of ungeared. I want to take it to geared, but the issue is that I don't have you gear for him. Nor I think I will make it. Because uh, on global, I'm just being the most optimal, and I know Zaurj is not a character I really use that much on JP. So I'm just trying to be more optimal on global than I am on JP. Because JP, I just go with everything, right? And just go for being a YouTuber and just ha doing everything, right? On global, I'm more of a player. I, I think more of a player. More as a player. Zaurj isn't really a character I want to invest your gear for. I made the mistake of carrying myself on and just giving trust to Rosa, which is so dumb. But only because it was fun, right? Alright, let's go first. Which means, actually means, that I can actually proc Zaldus' passive. Is it worth? I don't know. Don't know. That also means that he cannot push for an ultimate uh, by just combining cards and moving. Like he would be if I wasn't using Zaldus. Even with one ultimate gauge, if he has, like, King's extra card, right? He could combine cards, use it twice, and he'll get the ultimate. But now, he can't. Attacks you? Okay. Um... Do this? He had ranked up the, uh, you know, the Gulford, but... That's one proc of, of Zaldus' passive, and I'll hold on to the card, because... I actually don't want to attack, because I don't want to um, rank up Meliodas. That's a big big worry, of course, always. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is an opportunity of a lifetime. I will absolutely destroy the Meliodas. The level 3 attack right there? Yeah. I'm making the level 3 attack, I don't care. It would be more safe attacking twice and then level 2, but you really doing- Oh my god, you're really just asking for me to kill you. Tell me this is an Eevee. Tell me this is an Eevee. Okay, that- that's not even- not even fun, man. What you doing? I wanna be safe. If I didn't wanna be- Okay. I wanna be safe. So let me do this. I want to make sure Lost Vein is dead. And I'll use Zaldus' attack on Gulfer. Should have AoE'd with Melee, but it's fine. He really AoE'd, man. <laughs> he really AoE'd with Melee. Oh, no! <laughs> I wanted to kill Melee and then kill Gulfer with Zaldus. That would be like the most optimal. I'll play a match of Geared, just for higher numbers, but... I don't know if they... With how you are, Geared is kind of sad, but what can I do? Alright, so we have an issue, right? Oh, I, do, I don't know the... 
There's no way. Okay, this is a big issue. <laughs> All the defense related stats are buffed by 50. I did not know that. Oh, that's really unfortunate. Wait, this cancel stances, right? I think so. That's really unfortunate. I did not know that. Well, what I was gonna say is um, I have an issue, which is that I don't have any other attacking crit damage sets except for Meliodas. So I'm having issues attacking defense. And now there's another issue that apparently the PvP rule is that there's actually 50% <laughs> defense related stats. He's not gonna crit! Are you kidding me? Why did they release this rule with Zaldris? It makes no sense. They always make the rules help the character that they just released, so people are inclined to summon for the character. But this makes zero sense. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm going back to Ungear then. Because this is terrible. Just awful. Why would they do this? I mean, that means that I'm not gonna crit Meliodas, right? So... I can just do this. Why would they do this? It makes no sense. Yeah, without crediting, he does pitiful damage. He could Of course he did. <laughs> I didn't want to crit because I didn't want to rank up his cards, but... I mean... Man, I actually want to use level 3. He's probably gonna die because I ranked up Meliodas. But that's just weird, man. Why would they do that? Yeah, I'll, I'll go back to Ungeared. I'll, I'll wrap the video up on Ungeared. It was doing very well. Very, very well. He doesn't need your gear attacking crit damage to really perform. He can function in Ungeared. If the, if the, my enemy ever plays, of course. Yeah, my Slither is dead. That's unfortunate. Can you AoE with Meliodas, please? Just please? No? Okay. It's, it's just so odd. And he's always got the ultimate. Um, it's just so odd that they would do that. I'm losing the ultimate gauge. Eh, yeah, I, I couldn't push ults. You know what? I'm going back. Th this this was not made for blue Zal just to be played on. This is just so weird. By the way, just so we're clear, I won the match. My last thing got an ultimate. Uh, Zal just didn't do anything, so I'm not even gonna play it in. Uh, yeah. All right, let's uh, let's finish it up. Ooh, every team has uh, <laughs> every team is last fight, of course. Um, all right, let's just double attacking. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm he has after HP, so if you focus on using King, all right, give me Zardus cards. No, oh my God, that's not good. That's actually not good. I want a Zardus cards. <sighs> yeah, if he attacks seals me, uh, can he attack seal me and get Lost Fiend's ultimate? No, he can't. Yeah, he can't. Yeah, he tries to move a card to get ultimate. What? Okay. I don't know what he did. He, he he moved cards to get ult. I guess he just realized he didn't get the ult. I mean, it doesn't matter because he's gonna die. Like, Lost Vane's dead. I don't... I don't know what this guy just did. I really don't know what this guy just did. It's a real person. Bots wouldn't do that. Also, the match is laggy. And Champ 5 barely has bots, which is nice. I'm so confused. This is actually... Okay. Zaldrus can save you from a lot of things, but he can't... Zaldrus cannot save you from this. Um, if someone petrifies you and you have an ultimate, if you move a card, you lose the ultimate gauge, so you, can, you actually lose your ultimate. So there's no point. So I'm just doing this. Move the card so I'll get the uh, ultimate gauge thing. The passive. Kill the king. And yeah, it was a real player. Really odd. Anyways, uh, cool, cool, cool unit. The thing is, I don't recommend summoning because he's really cool and really fun, but... You know, the, the advantage of playing the global version is that you know what banners are coming up, and you know Goddess Liz is coming up. You don't need to summon for Zaldrus. You know there is gonna be a better unit, you know? 
Uh, that's the big advantage of playing global. I play in JP, never know what's coming next. So I just get <laughs> destroyed by banners non-stop. Like, they release Lilia, the, the red one, and I think, oh, she's the new best unit for the king team. Oh, but then they release Keo, which is now the best unit for the king team. And who knows who the next unit is going to be, you know? So they keep doing that on JP. On global, you know. Okay, so I skip Lilia because although she is... Like, when she released, she was the best unit for the king team. Keo is better, so I just will skip Lilia and summon for Keo. You know, stuff like that. And you can, you know, Zaljus is good, but not that good. And you can skip him to summon for a better unit. If you want, if you want him, just go for it. it I know you're dead.